right y'all so I'm going to give y'all a few like little spells that I use to give people who are wanting love spells or spells to get you a husband or a wife or to bind someone to you and I think I did a video like this before uh, a while back but I'll just give y'all a few spells that I am familiar with um, one is of course the love candle you can get a pink candle or a red candle and write the two of you's names on it and burn that candle it's like a seven day candle and burn it um, to bring you closer together um, then there's uh, the honey spell the sweetening spell you get a jar of honey or a bottle of honey and if it's a jar you write your name and your loved one's name on it and what you want like marriage I want to you know sweeten him to marriage her to marriage or to a deeper commitment and the relationship whatever and you put you fold the paper towards you and then you stick it inside the jar or you can stick it under the jar it doesn't matter but I like to stick it inside the jar and then you top the jar up and you get like a little red votive or a red tea light and take it out of the little tin foil thing and you light it on top of the jar and as the wax melts on top of it it'll seal you you guys love together and sweeten sweeten it as well another method you can use is the binding spell a freezer binding spell where you need a ziploc bag a piece of paper and some water you take the paper you write your name on it your loved one's name on it um, what you want to bind him to or her to like marriage or committed relationship you fold the paper towards yourself and then you stick the paper in the Ziploc bag and you fill it halfway with water and then you get all the air out you seal it and you lay it flat in your freezer and you let it freeze and that freezing is going to bind it together okay and as long as it stays frozen you'll stay bind it together so try not to thaw it out like stick it in the back of the freezer hide it whatever you need to do um, and then the other method that I like to use is taking the photograph of you and the other person faced together and then you can take a ribbon uh, pink or red ribbon and like um, go around the picture so that they're stuck together and then tie a knot like seven knots and <clears throat> put that somewhere safe so that you know you're always bound together these are a few ways that a lot of um, lovers and people in relationships seal their love and bind their love to one another now these don't work if the person is like don't even know your name or interested in you but the sweetening spell can make them nicer to you can attract them to you and all that kind of good stuff but the binding spells and stuff like that they're not going to work unless the person is already in the relationship with you so sweetening spell first if you're not in that relationship that you want to be in and then the binding spells afterward I know a lot of people don't believe in binding spells and love spells and doing all that kind of stuff but <clears throat> I believe that if you want something in your life, you have to really get active with it and you have to take steps towards it and you have to manipulate situations to get exactly what you want in life. If you know, that's how a lot of people live their life. Other people, you know, <clears throat> nothing against them, but they like to do it another way. But this is the method that I use and that's, you know, worked for me. So I just wanted to share that with y'all if y'all need some extra help. And I'm going to link this video to another video that I have on my other channel as well. And I will link that video to this video. So it's going to be in the description box. And um, the other video is actually describing some psychological uh, ways to get someone to want to marry you. Um, you know, so check that out if you're interested in that as well. Thank y'all so much for watching, and if y'all have any questions, please put them below, and I'll try to answer you. Okay? Thanks. Bye.